Hey everybody, I'm hanging out at the Roxy, the city's only indoor roller disco, and I am here with one of New York's most dynamic underground recording artists, the international pop sensation, Bon Bon Bon. My real name, the family name, is Bon 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 Bon. So those are five bonds, but I came to the U.S. and I realized that for show business, I might have to shorten it and make it a little catchier. I knew from a very young age that I did want to fly around the world and make life. Yeah. And I did some research and I found out this is what international pop stars do. I have always had Antwerp in my heart, but the thing about New York that I love is that you show up and uh, you pay your Con Edison bill and you're a New Yorker. Can you describe your music? When I got to the studio and went a documentary. Can you tell us about like what went into it, the process and your experiences? It's about, you know, making it in New York and doing your thing and just, you know, being what you are and uh, meeting a lot of girls. And really we were looking for a uh, chance to really showcase uh, my, my new sweatsuit and my belt buckle. The framework was done on Canal Street, um, of course right down the street, but the V's were made in Paris because I find that the letters they make in Paris are a little bit better. So we did go a little back and forth, and we were able to find a craftsman who could frame the Parisian letters within the New York Canal Street frame. That's a very unique piece. Let's get into the House of Bond. What's going on in the House of Bond right now? The penthouse view from the street. Feel the beat. House of Bond. I wanted a place where I could have all my friends over, but I wouldn't have to vacuum when they left. If you're first, so I made this house of bond that people can listen to on audio phones. All right, give it up for my man, Von Von Von, y'all. Von Von Von, tell us about your experience at the Apollo. Now every kid in Antwerp listens to the Apollo broadcast on the radio. We had a shortwave radio when I was growing up. One day I hear an ad on the radio, and I auditioned. I stood in line and I got accepted and I went on and then I sang and uh, I think we all fell in love with each other. It's very inspiring and there's a lot of love there and uh, I got to wear a fur vest that Sonny Bono actually willed to me. What's coming up? You got a clothing line, perhaps some accessories? I'm sure I've got some top designers right now working on uh, the V-neck sweater and perhaps working to ask us as well. Are there any tips you could give, say, a wannabe pop star? Just be yourself. Okay. And if that doesn't work, uh, be someone else. I just want to give a shout out to the streets of New York City. Everybody out there doing your thing has been such an inspiration to me. So if you're on the street, you're in the house.